Hey everyone, the Wolf Jedi here. We're back doing this Bella Box story. Let's continue. Servala. It really is you. Wait, Jepard, listen to me. When the sentry reported to me, I thought there must have been a misunderstanding. The enemy alarm had to be unrelated to your entry into the restricted zone. Perhaps the intruders had taken you hostage. And yet. Step away from the intruder, Serval. Walk over slowly and stand behind me. You're different from them. I'm sorry. We have an understanding. I stand with them. <sighs> Give me a few minutes, just a few. I'll explain every- Enough, Serval. <gasps> have you forgotten where we are? We Landouts ought to know this place better than anywhere. The outer reaches of the front line against the Fragmentum. Bellabog's most strategic protective fortress. Every Silver Main guard here, every person here, is ready to sacrifice themselves. Ready to spill their blood for Bellabog at a moment's notice. Fool's errand. Yet here you are, leading fugitives into the restricted zone. Attacking my Silver Main comrades in arms. Hijacking the energy hub. Are you really worthy of the Landau name? Why do you think I've come here? We found a way to dispel the Eternal Freeze, to seal the Fragmentum. It might be the only lifeline this world has left. If that were true, why wouldn't you report to Madame Kokolia? Why would you sneak into the Restricted Zone and create chaos? Because she's under the influence of the, of the, um, of the, um, uh, the, uh, Whatever it is, I can't get the name. You don't understand. The one preventing us from getting close to the truth is Kokolia herself. You have all seen the Supreme Guardian in person. Do you think you can act as you please because she didn't recognize your version of events? Listen to me, Jepard. The origin and spread of the Fragmentum is linked to the Stellaron. Stellaron, that's what it is. In the architect's records, it's... I know about the Stellaron. It's exactly what the fugitives behind you are seeking. But the Madam Guardian has already revealed the truth to me. These people have ulterior motives, Serval. They want to steal this treasure from the architects. The Madam Guardian has warned me before that you were indulging in fantasy. That you'd been exposed to forbidden knowledge. And that you would bring destruction down upon Bellabog. I believe you, Serval. I believe you think you're acting with loyalty to the people. It's just... Guards, formation. Arrest these people. We could be inundated with Fragmentum monsters at any moment. We have no time to waste on them. The forbidden is only forbidden to conceal the truth within. Kokoli is afraid that we'll seize on this knowledge. That the truth will spread far and wide. To save the world, we must risk it all. I've said my piece. Whether you believe it or not is up to you. Regardless, you should know by now your sister's never been one to back down. If there's something or someone you can't abide, you should stand up and resist. And if there's something you uphold, you should uphold it to the very end. Save your explanation for the judge. You are charged with sabotaging the Silver Main Guard restricted zone. In my capacity as captain, I hereby order that these fugitives be arrested. This isn't like our childhood game, Serval. You won't get any leniency from me. The barrier hasn't been fixed yet. Don't try and be a hero, Jepard. But didn't I tell you? All our negotiations end in combat. Nice look on the on the on Trailblazer's face. Okay. Our position is solid. Stay calm. Ow. All right. I won't go easy on you. Look at you, Alice. Give an inch, and they'll definitely take a mile. 
let's see. You know what? I always make good on my promises. Naughty children don't listen. Nap time. How? Okay, yeah, that's right. Stand down. Okay. Just in time. Just a little something. <laughs> Think nothing of it. Time you treat, please. Yeah. You know nothing of the weight behind this power. Witness the stars shatter before you. Survive or be destroyed. There is no other choice. He's in break. <laughs> Time for a shot. You're in bad shape. as I am. It could be an argument or a fight. He'll do both to the death. That's why he bugs the heck out of me. It's just me and, my, me and Michelle, my sister. That's enough, Jafard. Take a look around you. You're the last man standing. Even if I am, I won't yield. I don't need you to yield. I don't want you to yield through force of arms. That wouldn't be a victory for us. Yeah, our goal is the same as yours, Sir Balls and Ranya's. We just want to preserve this world. There's no reason to turn against each other. Japard, brother, surely now you can see the need for pragmatism. Even if you don't believe my outsider friends, you should believe me. Maybe I've wasted your trust. In which case, believe Bronya. Lady Bronya. Uh huh. There's nothing more to say, Jepard. The decision is yours. As a captain of the Silver Mane Guards, I am duty bound to carry out the orders of the Supreme Guardian. Our answer, but Lady Bronya is the commanding officer for the front line. According to military protocol, if the front line directives of the commanding officer clash with those of the architects behind the lines, a soldier must remain at their post and await further directives. Thanks for, thanks for the decision. For the Silvermane Guards, the Guardian's orders are paramount and absolute. But there is something of equal importance in the oath we take. 
The people of Falabog. Yep. If we lose the people, we lose the reason for our existence. Our fight with the Fragmentum monsters is for the sake of preservation. But our fight with you, I fail to see the purpose. It's like he says in his, his uh, trailer. So remain guards of Bellalog's indestructible shield. If you are truly able to prevent our endlessly unfolding misfortune, then the people of Bellabog are indebted to you. But if you are using lies to mask your true intentions, using my sister and Branya for your own ends, I swear by Klopoth that I will carry out your punishment without an ounce of mercy. Fully noted. You're not lying. I promise you. You must be Zila. You are a skilled fighter. Your combat style is nothing like that of the guards. Regardless of what you believe, these guys have been a great help to the underworld. Many people would vouch for them. Mm -hmm. I'm sure. If you want to advance further northward, you must traverse an area entirely corroded by the Fragmentum. It's the only way to get to the snow plains on the other side. The guards can give you some time before the next wave of attacks is upon us. All right. <sighs> let's talk to well. Let's 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 look around here. I'm actually pull up. Me. What do I have on her? Her attack is pretty high. Okay, no, I can't send her. Yeah, I'm, a, well, I'm still in my equilibrium too. I'm going to go ahead and send this in. Yeah. Okay. She's probably doing a lot more damage. Uh, yeah, so far I have this on. Uh, I don't know. Tears of Dreams. Do I have Tears of Dreams? Oh, that's what I get. Wait, how many of these do I have? Oh, yeah, I got plenty. Okay. Yeah, I have this on my, um, on on uh, Jade. I was trying for a like on didn't get it. Okay. Should have done this a while back. This is what I have on on uh, my um on well. Yeah, I know. I, um, I got quite a few of these, so I can do this. Should have done this a while back already. Anywho, yeah. So let's go ahead. And... I gotta admit, I had a lot of misunderstandings about the Silvermane Guards. They're fighting for survival here every day. Just like Waldfire. The difference is we're making a stand for freedom. Well, they're just carrying out orders. Why wait? Of course I do. I've understood them for a while now. But as far as I can tell, she doesn't need other people's understanding. She needs to understand her own heart. Yeah. It's the same with Japard. 
I could tell it took a lot for him to lay down his arms. Put ourselves in their shoes? Easier said than done. Everyone has their struggles. But how can we understand them if we can't even see each other? I think I can already hear the storm on the other side of the city walls. Not a reassuring sound. I hope Sir Val's right. That supreme lunatic better not have harmed Branya. Mm, I've seen some stuff around with this. I'm gonna go and look around over here real quick. Uh, oh, treasure chest. Quick, snatch it all up. Yeah. Let's see if there's anything on the other side. Oh. Nope. Let's go and talk to Serval. You see, brothers and sisters need to have a scrap once in a while to get back on good terms. I know that all too well. Uh, enough apologizing. My ears can't take any more. Honestly, this would have <laughs> happened sooner or later. You just gave me an excuse to bring everything forward. What's wrong with a bit of violent coexistence between siblings? Seems pretty normal to me. I've only hit my sister once. That's how she knew how far she can push me. Keep that in mind, Michelle, if you ever watch this. <laughs> I'm pulling your leg. Since I left the military, my brother and I have always steered clear of certain sensitive topics. <sighs> Thinking about it, perhaps he's just been looking out for my feelings, shielding me all along. Knowing my temper, my brother almost certainly went to great lengths on many occasions for me. I should be thanking him. Let's do this. I may never have come face to face with it, but this Stellaron cost me a nice, stable job. It's time to get even. Actually, yep. I have another selfish motive. I want to prove to Kokolia that I was right. Once we've taken care of the Stellaron, maybe she'll go back to how she was. Sorry, uh, hardly the time for me to be obsessing over all this. As we I got this. If we want to progress further north, we're going to have to cross that hell. Still, look at it this way. Just another arena to showcase our skills, right? Now, if you're ready to get on stage, let's push for that standing ovation. Let's do this. Okay. Okay. Or anything else? No. <sighs> as soon as the restricted zone gate is open, the monsters on the other side will turn out in full force. The guards will do their best to stall them and buy you some time. Once you've broken through the front line, there's nothing more we can do for you. You'll have to find out for yourselves what lies within the northern fragmentum. So, have you made up your minds? We're ready. Understood. Keep your weapons close. This will be a fierce fight. Guards, open the gate. Are you dealing with attacks like this every day? It's a common occurrence. Guards, formation. <laughs> Well, I'm going to make sure I don't owe the guards any favors when this is done. <laughs> For Bronya. Here they come. Steal yourselves. You can still walk away. All right. A little better. You've got a loose 
some to win some. Don't let me down now. Ow. <laughs> Time for a shot. You're in bad shape. <laughs> Leave the rest to me. Stand down. Done. Okay. <laughs> Naughty children, don't listen. Favor the vigor of <laughs> I'm okay. You can still walk away. <laughs> All right. Forget your wallet. <laughs> Bending the rules, are we? I wish I had Sela. She's still doing yeah, she's still doing it. Okay. Yeah, I can do this. Yeah, if I was wearing my glasses, I'd be doing that. I told you, Jafar, the barrier hasn't been fixed yet. Don't try and be a hero. This is only the first wave. They'll have reassembled soon. I have to. Hey, Mr. Silvermane, listen to your sister. I can tell just by looking at you that you haven't fully recovered. <sighs> Outsiders. Zila, the second wave hasn't started yet. Make the most of this opportunity and make a break for it. Huh? Uh, Sir Bo, aren't you gonna look for the Stellaron with us? My brother can't hold them back by himself. He wasted a lot of energy on us. It's my responsibility now. Besides, if I'm not here to help, I don't know what might happen in the next wave. I want to go with you. I do. I always wanted to catch a glimpse of the Stellaron with my own eyes, and now it's so close. But I can't abandon my brother and the other guards. I'm a Landau. It's up to you now. I believe in you. You've given me new hope. So far. Get hold of the Stellaron before Kakolia realizes what's happening. We won't disappoint you. Hey, March. Don't forget to take a picture of the Stellaron for me. Say no more. We're good at this. Don't worry. Fragmentum activity is intensifying. Something's happening on Eurelo 6. Shouldn't we go down there, Himiko? <laughs> Have faith in them. Besides, this is her first trailblazing expedition. How will she be able to look back fondly without a few twists and turns? Are you bored, Welt? I understand. But we have lots of opportunities ahead of us. Let's leave the memories of this expedition for them. 
So you think we'll be safe, right? Yes. We haven't seen any Eon or Emanator level imaginary reactions. Relax. This is a young person's adventure. We shouldn't interfere. At most, we could offer a little off site assistance. Is this the fragmentum Japard was talking about? Compared to this, the corrosion we saw in Backwater Pass pales into insignificance. How can we pinpoint the Stellaron? Said that the Stellaron was very likely hidden in the snow plains north of Velabar. If we want to get there, I'm afraid we'll have to find the exit to this fragmentum maze first. Guys, does this place feel weird to you? It feels like, like there are loads of eyes staring at us. This place makes my flesh crawl, like there are insects under my skin. We have no guide and no way of detecting the Stellaron. We'll just have to advance gradually and cautiously. Don't be disheartened. The stronger the fragmentum contamination, the closer we are to the source. We will continue that in the next video. See you then.